Steve Cardenas was the second Mighty Morphin Red Power Ranger. He was also Zeo Ranger 3 Blue. He'll soon be making his return in Mighty Morphin Power Rangers once and always. It's Morphin Time! Red Ranger Power! Tara! Rocky DeSantos was the second Mighty Morphin Red Power Ranger. His journey to become the new Red Power Ranger starts with meeting Tommy Oliver, Kimberly Hart, and Billy Cranston after saving a baby along with his friends Adam Park and Aisha Campbell. The three of them were visiting Angel Grove to represent Stone Canyon in the Team Ninja competition. Because of his skill as a martial artist, Rocky became an immediate target of Lord Zed once he defeated his prospective future Dark Rangers. Along with Adam and Aisha, he ends up kidnapped and thrown into the Dimension of Despair. Two three darlings have been personally chosen by His Majesty Lord Zed! <laughs> Lord who? Luckily, the Power Rangers came to rescue them just in time. Rocky, Adam, and Aisha discovered the Rangers' identities when Tommy and Kimberly had to take off Billy's helmet. Rocky, Adam, and Aisha were later taken to the command center to meet Zordon and were sworn to secrecy. Yeah, we're great. Thanks to the Power Rangers. The three eventually moved to Angel Grove permanently and were requested by Zordon to help while the Rangers were away. Rocky was chosen to replace Jason Lee Scott as the Red Mighty Morphin Power Ranger after Jason and his fellow Rangers Trini Quan and Zack Taylor were selected to attend the peace conference in Geneva. Rocky was entrusted with the powers of the Tyrannosaurus Power Coin and the Red Dragon Thunder Zord. In the non-canon movie Mighty Morphin Power Rangers the movie, Steve Cardenas portrayed a similar version of his character from the television series, who receives new powers and becomes the Red Ninja Ranger. He harnesses the spirit of the ape and controls the ape ninja Zord to defeat Ivan Ooze with the team. Unlike the television series, Rocky's Red Ranger costume was more of an armored look. In Season 3, the Thunderzords were destroyed by Rita Revolto, thus also destroying the original Dinozords and damaging the power coins beyond use. Rocky later gained new ninja powers of the ape, becoming the Red Ninja Ranger and also gained the ability to pilot the Red Ape Ninja Zord. Despite not being the leader, Rocky twice had to face a monster that had incapacitated the entire team by himself. You picked the wrong day to mess with me, Laceface. The Rangers managed to get the Zeal Crystal, but wanted to make sure that Master Vile couldn't get it again, so the Rangers split it into five sub-crystals and sent them to different points in history. Master Vile then turned back time using the Orb of Doom, turning the Rangers back into children. The Rangers soon recruited the Alien Rangers to fight in their stead. Each Ranger went on their own little quest for their sub-crystal. Rocky's quest for his sub-crystal took him back to Mexico, where he met a young boy who was actually a younger version of his grandfather. The sub Crystal turned out to be the maw of a near active volcano. With some climbing equipment, Rocky retrieved the crystal before the volcano erupted. Rocky was the first to return to the present with his crystal. Delphine, now I know what you were talking about. A journey into your heritage will always bring a rich reward. When he returned back to his adulthood, Rocky and the others had to escape the doomed command center from a planted bomb by Rito and Godar. From the wreckage, the rangers found the Zeo crystal and the entrance to the power chamber, where Zordon and Alpha were still alive. However, a new threat to Earth came in the form of King Mondo and his machine empire. With their old powers destroyed, the rangers had to harness the Zeo crystal for new powers to battle the empire. The triangle subcrystal allowed Rocky to become Zeo Ranger 3, Blue. During this time, Rocky faced a new set of villains and adventures. When Mondo and the Empire started getting stronger, Rocky and the Zeal Rangers were assisted by the mysterious Gold Ranger. The Gold Ranger was an alien named Trey from the planet Triforia. When Trey's powers were threatened, Rocky's predecessor, Jason Lee Scott, came back to assume the powers. It's really good to have you with us again, buddy. It's good to be back, man. Just like old times. With Jason as the Gold Ranger, Rocky soon began to feel left out and also felt he was being replaced by the Ranger he replaced. Trying to prove his worth, he attempted to take on King Mondo by himself. It was only afterwards he realized he was an important part of the team as well as a friend to Jason. I mean, hey, you know, you can't save the world without working together, right? Right. That's right. And working together, we accomplished something I never thought we would.
in the Turbo A Power Rangers movie, during a practice match, Rocky threw himself into a kick and wound it up landing and causing his spine to go further into his back. While he recuperated in the hospital, his friends were facing a new danger, and Zordon had to recruit a new ranger of a young boy named Justin Stewart, who Rocky chose to take his place. Great. I still can't believe you don't want your powers back, Rocky. It's so cool being a ranger. Yeah, but you know, I got a lot of stuff to do with my karate school and... I don't know. I think the power's in good hands. In the final episode of Power Rangers Super Mega Force Legendary Battle, Rocky returned as Zeo Ranger 3, blue with his fellow Zeo Rangers, as part of the army of legendary rangers led by Tommy as the green Mighty Morphin Power Ranger. In the Ninja Steel special Dimensions in Danger, Rocky was contacted by who he thought was Tommy, but was actually a robot duplicate in disguise. Rocky was among the legendary rangers who were kidnapped and taken to the Antiverse by Lord Draven. Fortunately, Rocky and the other captives were soon rescued by fellow legendary rangers. Rocky morphed and joined the rest of the rangers to help fight against Draven's army in an epic battle. Your invasion ends here, Draven! Steve Cardenas will finally return to the role of Rocky DeSantos in Mighty Morphin Power Rangers once and always. He is joined by fellow rangers Billy Cranston, Aisha Campbell, Adam Park, Kat Hillard, Trini's daughter Min, and for the very first time ever, fight alongside Zack Taylor. In what promises to be an epic reunion and showdown with the return of an old upgraded foe, Robo Rita Repulsa. It's surreal, it's been a great experience. Despite replacing Jason Lee Scott and not being the true leader of the Power Ranger teams, Rocky proved he was always a valuable member of the Power Rangers.